What's up guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video guys, this is very, very bad for Bitcoin. Yes, in yesterday's video guys, or even the previous video, I was warning you when Bitcoin was up here, when Bitcoin was here, we will be coming back down to this price level right here and look exactly the price level we came to. Well, we came all the way down to $16,950. Yes, I am in a very, very small short position right now. It's actually high leverage, but small margin. Uh, only $2,600 in profit. Guys, I'm going to tell you exactly where I think the Bitcoin price is going to be going next because we have broken this level right here, which definitely could be very, very dangerous for Bitcoin, pushing it further, even further down than originally we wanted to go. So guys, as always, sit back, relax and get ready for the video. All right, guys, welcome back to another video and thank you for joining me once again. As always, I want to say a massive thank you for all your support on all my videos. Let's smash 500 likes in today's video and that will make me very, very happy. So let's jump into the charts, see what exactly has been going on with Bitcoin because honestly, right now it's a pretty wild ride. We can see from the top here around 18,400 all the way down here. It's around an 8% dip. Again, nothing really like amazingly crazy, but definitely on the short term, on the hourly chart, this is a large dip towards the downside. If we take a look at the four hour chart, we take a bit of a zoom out, we can kind of understand where we are in the market right now. First of all, we got rejected from this level right up here, which I talked about in my previous videos. I was saying it was going to come because of this level of rejection right there. And if we zoom out as well, we can see that this level um, if I just raise the chart a little bit so you can see this better, this level is very, very important because look at this support support, support, resistance, resistance. This is a very strong level. We cannot just go up and break this level so easily, um, especially not with the volume that we have. We, if we take a look at the volume which we broke this with, or we tried to break this with, we can see that definitely it's it's not amazing. When we were up here, although the volume was quite good coming, coming up here, we can see right there, quite high volume. We had a low, quite high volume, although lower volume, and we're having lower volume and we're at a higher price. And if we go over to the, for example, the daily chart, we can see right here, when we're trying to get this break right here, the volume is, if anything, a little bit above average, but it's not anything crazy that's gonna really push through this strong level of uh, resistance. We can see this level of resistance dates all the way back to uh, June of this year. So six, seven months level of resistance. We're not gonna break through it that easily, honestly, guys. Um, it's gonna take a lot more than that. I do wanna to talk to you about my trade, but first of all, I wanna to talk to you about Bybit's four year anniversary, and they're actually giving away over $1 million in prizes, up to $1 million in prizes. You can win stuff like a car, 100 iPhones, you can win Bit tokens, and many other things as well. All you have to do is click the link down below, you'll see Bybit, Bybit giveaway, and then you can go ahead and click join the celebration. If you haven't got an account, simply make one and you can go ahead and enter into this prize. Uh, and um, yeah, you could win some very, very cool things. I'm gonna do it myself, I recommend you do, because who doesn't like free prizes and giveaways? So a quick little bit of information about my trade. Again, this is a very, very risky trade. It's a 25X trade around a, um, $53,000 trade, and I'm currently in around $2,600 in profit. This is unrealized, of course. Realize is negative 127. Just wanna be completely open and transparent with you guys. But I'm gonna leave this trade open. I think looking, looking here, the potential of us pushing down towards here, this could absolutely expl explode that trade. So I'm willing to leave it open with this high leverage. Of course, 25 at leverage is a little bit high. I don't recommend you trading on this unless you're very experienced, but a further 8% down could be very, very interesting to leave this trade open for a nice bit of profit. So most likely that's what I'm gonna do. Um, talking about Bitcoin in the short term, I think we probably, honestly, we will have a bounce from this level, some form of a bounce, maybe back up to 17,500 up to this level right there before most likely getting rejected again. And that's gonna be the real time where it tests where we are going to go next. If we do drop below here, this could be very scary. As I've said in many videos in the previous weeks and months, if we drop below this 15K, it could be 13K, it could be 10K just as quick as that, which we definitely don't want to see. So um, yeah, I'll keep you updated about that. This chart is still on though, which I'll talk about in a minute, but this is the chart on the short term, on the four hourly chart, which I'm a little bit concerned about. We've already broken it, and if we take a look at the potential price target here, we can see that pulling this to the breakout, 
this would give us a price target of $15,100. Of course, that would not be nice, but that's why I'm keeping that short position open because from here, all the way down here would be a further 11%. And that's why I want to keep the short position open. And um, of course, do your own research, but there could be some opportunities in the charts right there um, for you on this. Again, we broke this. We had a strong level of support right here going all the way up here. Strong, strong level. Yes, we broke it a little bit. And then we retested it and we broke the upper side. We tested it exactly like we did there. And uh, we broke towards the downside. So this could potentially have us coming down to around that 15K level. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. I will enter you for the giveaway next Monday as well. I would love to know your thoughts. If you think we're going to 15K, or do you think we're gonna pump back up to 18K or somewhere along those levels? I do wanna quickly talk about uh, this chart and then we'll get onto the Bitcoin rainbow chart in a second. And um, yeah, take a look at this. 5.5 year support, $81,000 US target. If you've been a subscriber to the channel or a loyal, view loyal viewer, you know I've been talking about this chart a lot. And just don't worry about these small dumps because long-term, I think we are gonna be just fine. These small dumps, they don't really phase me because I've been in Bitcoin now for, uh, around five years, coming on to six years. So it doesn't really matter so much about these small dumps. It's major, mainly the, the larger moves. If you've been in crypto just a few weeks, few months, maybe even less than a year, of course, these eight, nine, 10% dumps are gonna get you a little bit um, scared. However, I really wouldn't worry about it too much. When we're taking a look at charts like this, the Bitcoin rainbow chart, or in this market, it could maybe pr be referred to this and actually following a rainbow because right now we are looking very bearish. Um, but yeah, uh, it's in a basically a fire sale, which is down here showing us that if you look at the bottom category there, uh, basically a fire sale between 13,480 and basically $18,000. So anything in these ranges is definitely a fire sale, a, a good time to buy Bitcoin. It predicted this when Bitcoin was back here at around $4,000 with the Rona dump. It predicted it back here in 20. 2016 as well. I wasn't in Bitcoin in this time. I just got in around about uh, mid 2017. But yeah, I think this could be a very, very interesting chart. And if you're looking to load up on Bitcoin, definitely could be the right time to do it. So again, guys, I don't want you to miss out on these up to $1 million worth of USDD giveaways. Uh, you can win a car, win iPhones, loads of crazy stuff to celebrate Bybit's fourth year anniversary. Again, down below in the description and the top pinned comment, you'll see the exact link to join Bybit and you can go ahead and claim and join in with this celebration. I really wouldn't miss it. Again, my back trade on Bybit, $2,600. I'm leaving it open. Let's see where Bitcoin goes in the next few hours and days and I'll update you tomorrow, guys. As always, thank you for watching today's video. I'll catch you in the next one.